Welcome everyone. So ladies, gentlemen, um, Madam Mayor, um, I'd like to welcome you to this event today to celebrate the successful completion of the Community Reporters course by a group of young volunteers, Leanne, Lee, Laura, Gemma. I've come at the invitation of the young people to see the finished product of what they've been doing the weeks they've been here at uh, Supporting Age Concern. I, I had an interview with them shortly after they were set up and we talked in depth, in fact I talked, I was frightened, I didn't take notes, so I just sat there and said well I'll tell you where I'm from and, and what it's about and then gave them questions and they didn't know whether to ask any or not but they were, they listened, which was important and then they asked me would I, would I be there for older people's day, obviously I was, they were absolutely fantastic and they worked with the older people in the in the computer room. Nothing was too much. They were absolutely fantastic. They listened. They were so courteous to the older people. And, you know, they were brilliant. Can't put any other word to it. Hello. Welcome to our event. My name's, um, my name's Tony Hill. Over the last 13 weeks, we have been training to be community reporters. Here is a video we have made over the weeks about what we have been doing. We hope you enjoy our presentation. This is our blog where we post all our pictures, videos and audio. We've learned how to plan, record and edit videos and how to upload them to the internet. We have learned how to use audio equipment to record interviews and edit them for the internet. We have also gained confidence in interviewing members of the public. We have improved our confidence in taking <laughs> photos. We direct people where to stand in order to tell a story. Confidence and friendship! If you want to volunteer, come to H Concern. It's full of happy, friendly people. It's a great opportunity, so go for it. I hope you have enjoyed our presentation. My name's Leo. As you can see from the video, we have gained more skills and become more confident. We think this will help us in the future. Myself, Tonya, Laura, uh, Lee, Laura <laughs> and Gemma would like, uh, have all enjoyed working as a team. We would like to say a big thank you to David from People's Voice Media and Claudia and everyone from Each Consumer. The key bit is as well that they have finished the community reporting programme. It might have seemed a long time ago back in August, but I know you have worked really hard. And one of the things that we like to do is when people have completed the community reporters course is to reward you by giving you a certificate and the badge and I can't remember what else is in that bag. You'll find that in a minute. But well, should we just get each person to come up individually? I'm going to start with Gemma. Thank you. That's fine. Alright. 
Antonio. Antonio. I work on the Community Task Force programme in Rotherham. Well, I first met Claudia several months ago now and wanted to give opportunities to the young people who were coming on the programme to get involved with community activities and through uh, age concern and also through the funding Claudia had got at that particular time we were able to settle through People's Voice Media, the Community Reporter Programme that's obviously the young learners who have actually come onto the programme now have successfully completed. It's amazing to actually see the development of the young people who have actually been on the Community Reporter Programme the way they've actually developed as a person their way their confidence have increased as they've actually gone through the programme. Feeling good about themselves and about what they're actually doing while uh, since they've been on the programme as well and the feedback they've actually given each time they've come back into centre has been excellent. To be quite honest they've wanted to stop out of centre more and just work on the programme as opposed to actually uh, coming into centre but uh, you know it has been a pleasure to see and it's been an honour to be able to come today to see the final result. What we would like to do is obviously through CTS training is wherever possible if this could be developed and to look at you know giving other people the opportunities in the future that these young ones have been given you know, over the last 13 weeks. <laughs> I sort of pulled the project together in the first place. I wasn't sure quite how it was going to work. I'm really pleased with the results. Not only got some really good people, but they produced some really good videos for themselves, but also for Age Concern Rotherham. I, I tried not to have too many expectations, but um, I was I think I was really encouraged by their enthusiasm and the fact that they were um, prepared to take on projects without too much of, too much um, of my lead um, they were to they took responsibility for the projects that are from beginning to end and um, they didn't need too much prompting really um, and with the help of David's there, their tutor, they, they did a really good job. I'm really impressed by, by the quality and the fact that, that because they didn't know each other beforehand, um, they had to get to know each other as a team and know find out their, their own strengths and weaknesses as well. I don't think they worked with older people before and they had to make phone calls, they had to interview people um, and really get to know older people and especially with the Care Home project they were interviewing people and having to um, make allowances for people who really couldn't hear them very well. <laughs> um, and to, to talk at a different pace and tone, etc. So, and I noticed, I've seen the development of the, um, the videos themselves, the quality of the videos has improved from, from the very beginning to, to, the, to the end of the project. So, as well as them developing, I can see that they've de their quality of the, the finished product is, is developed. It's been really good to see their family and friends supporting them. The fact that they're happy with their achievements as well.